I'm Anna Karin and I have a blog called Layers of Ink where I share inspiration and tutorials. I have been stamping, paper crafting and doing mixed media art for about 15 years now and I love to try out different types of projects and different techniques and I really enjoy teaching what I have learned in my experiments. And I'm happy to be back here with another class at Skillshare and I was planning to have um, recorded this introduction video outdoors today but it was really windy so it didn't work out and it's it's a kind of bleak February day we don't have snow it's one of those days where you you're looking forward to spring and one of the things that makes me think of spring is flowers and I love to make my own uh, flowers three-dimensional flowers from different materials and flowers you know, they fit any time, any time of the year for so many different projects and, well, flowers simply make me happy. So I thought I'd do a little series with classes um, showing you some techniques for flower making. Most of them are very simple and you don't need a lot of materials to do them either. I'm going to start out with a favourite of mine, which is tissue paper flowers. I just love the idea of taking something so plain as tissue paper and turning it into something beautiful. You need very few supplies for this class. You need tissue paper, a pair of scissors and something to attach the tissue paper together with like a stapler or brad. And you can also you, you can also recycle tissue paper that you get uh, that you've gotten in a gift box. I'll show you how to cut and um, give dimensional life to the flowers. And uh, we're going to make flowers in different sizes. I'll also show you some idea ideas for how you can color the flowers and how you can add patterns with stamps. Finally, I'll, I'll give some tips about adding leaves and stems to your flowers. Uh, I had lots of fun making tissue paper flowers for this class. I made a whole bunch of flowers in different colors and I have now have a big supply of tissue paper flowers to use on projects. You could use them as embellishments on cards, for instance, like I did here, uh, or on, um, on gift packaging, like on this little project. And they also look great um, at home decor items. You could put them in a vase or um, you could display them all in a big bowl. I put a lot of flowers in this big glass bowl. They look really nice together and definitely makes me think of spring. So I hope you'll join me in this class and I, I'm, I think you'll enjoy making some tissue paper flowers. It's quick and easy and simple and a lot of fun. See you in class. Bye!